stopped. Okay. Fine. All right then. Well, you must wait with that. Uh, all right. And we're back to the beginning again. Back to our banded jacks. So we've got ten seconds rest. Are we ready? Let's go. You might want to have the band just around your calves, so don't slip down. Sorry, I had to take that. It's a very nice chat because sometimes there's some decorating work for me. And uh, I want to get my stroller. a bit lower. Should be easier this side to start on the left side. Five, right side dominant. Three, two, one. Well rest. done. Okay, we are going to have the band around our feet and start on the side step. Standing tall, hips forward. Put your pelvis tucked under. The bottom is sticking out, you're not getting nearly as much out of it. Keep imprinting that good body position. Hips forward. Thank you. 
That's it, very nicely coordinating everybody. Tuck and look. Pulling your arms all the way back, open your chest. That's it. We're so good at this now, all this practice. I mean, the sounds that we made a year ago, it's a very quiet place now. Oh, well done. Okay, we're going to try and do, I'm not sure it's going to work with a slightly heavier weight, uh, a weighted donkey kick. So, if you can, uh, if, you, if you've got a very heavy weight, you may not be a good idea. But if you want to tuck the weight uh, behind your knee, like so. Do you think we can manage that? I'm going to set the time on, got a few more seconds. Three, two, one, that's one. Is that alright, Kimberly? Yeah. Well done. Oh. Is he giving away to the little bit of a squeeze? Keep it in place for a few seconds. Keeping the hips in a stable position. 15 seconds. Thank you. 
Keep your hips stuck so you're not leaning over like this. Thank you. 
We're going to do leg lifts next, so just as high as you can get your legs, right side, so both legs together. Control. Nearly there. Five, 
squeeze when you get to the top. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. And single leg, so we're extending our right leg away. Pushing up to the left heel, bringing the right leg to 45 degrees and lower, keeping the hips high. The leg is moving, the hips are staying high. Pushing through the left heel. And now take it up to 90, into 45. Hips stay high. And now passing up.
10 jacks or step jacks. You want to do no impact. I need this with a magnifying machine to bump my bit of paper. Cross country. Tall, hips forward, and letting the heels come down. High knees. Heels coming down. Heel flips. Then squat jumps. Lunges. And back to the beginning now, there's Jo. She's going to take my nice two kilogram weight. <laughs> Reverse lunges. Right inside the elbows. 
the other way around. Get the elbows right inside the knees. And now, placing your feet, your, the balls of your feet, on your mat, we're going to do calf raises. So if your mat is too, if this is too high, you might have to unroll it a little bit. Pressing down through the balls of the feet, coming up and lowering. We get a little bit of a heel drop here. So just the balls of your feet are on the mat. And your heels are coming all the way to the ground. All the way up, all the way down. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, standing on our right leg, we are just going to do a little bit of ankle mobility. So right leg is your stance leg, and we are going to do some ankle circles. Four, three, two, one, left. Got too soon. It's all good. Too keen today. It's the rare appearance of the sun. And back the other way. See if you can get your knee up as well, and we're getting extra into it by working the hip flexor and now pulsing the foot all the way up, all the way down, flex, point, flex, point, it's not really a pulse, but you know what I mean. And take it down, we're going to change legs, so let's centre the weight, this is a bit strange, we seem to have a lot of rest here. <laughs> I'm going, to, I'm, I'm going to deal with that. Otherwise, we just won't get it done. Okay, let's go. I've started off with a flexion point, so it doesn't really matter which you do, but I'll tell you when it's halfway, we'll change to whichever you're not doing. And now circles. Keep the knee high. And back the other way. Five, four, three, two, one. Right, you're going to do ten squats, and I'm going to play with this. Um, great, what's going on? Fifteen seconds, we don't need that. Okay, ten seconds. All right, so we're going to go for single leg squats. So hinging back with the hips and pressing forward, but don't forget it's about the squat. It's not, we're not, it's not about a bend. Really want that, to, or rather a fold of the waist. We really want the knee to bend and the ankle. Hips go back, hips come forward. So centre the weight through the left leg, let's get into that squatting position and let's go. Bend the knee, straighten, bend the knee, straighten. Don't get distracted by what's happening with your hips or your arms, it's all about bending the knee. Try to get lower to the ground. Strengthening the ankle. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Well done. Okay, single leg RDL. So you can do this weighted. Let's go. Oh, do you want to swap? Do you want this one? No, I, it's kind of, I mean, it's horrid for you. Yeah. You sure? Yes, no. <laughs> I've not given myself a little room here. There we go. Hinging at the waist. Changing leg. Five, 
So you want your weight in the opposite hand to the stance leg. Well done, everybody. Okay, back to the beginning of the round. Quickly roll up your mat. We're going to go for the deep squat. Can we do it in time? Yes, everyone's not brilliantly. Okay, so heels on the mat. Let's go. All the way down. Get the elbows inside the knees, pushing out. Seconds with both, come on, focus. And right leg, might have got on the strike. Definitely gets harder the more you do it, doesn't it? It's like a I know, yes. Very good for your upper body. Going for the uh, tip anterior. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We are going to do single leg gate openers. So we're going to start by standing on our left leg, up, open, close, down, up, open, close, down. Relax the toes of the standing foot, no gripping. I can see gripping. Relax the toes, splay them out. Can we open a little bit wider? Squeeze, back, down. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Rest. Relax. And we're going to go again. Five, Standing on our right leg. Three, nice two, and tall, hips one, forward. Left. Lift, open, close, lower. You can keep your feet from touching the floor. If you need to reset by putting your foot down, you can. Let's get that knee a little bit wider. All the way over and back and down. Control. Last one of 
this round, we're going to do our single leg RDL. We're going to start off with our left Five, leg as our stance leg. Three, two, one. Let's go. Left. Nearly there. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. And change legs. So right leg is the stance leg. Hinging from the hips, touching forward. Let's go. Through the heel to standing. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Well done. Okay. So, set two. We'll have our weight. We are going to. Lunge, but pulse like so. So we're not coming down very deep. You don't really need your mat, but you can. We can unfurl our mat when we've got more time. Let's get into it. Halfway. You can go a little bit lower, but keep up the momentum. Keep up. Keep up the tempo. Beginning to feel it. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, rest. And change. Five, four, three, two, one, Let's rest. go. Yes, we'll definitely need the mat for the next one. Don't need to go too deep, keep it fast. Seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, definitely need your mat. We're going to do prisoner presses. So, we are coming down onto the mat, press, and coming up. Down onto the mat, alternate your descending knee. Press as we come up. last week where we had to do in pairs um, paper scissors stone and then the winner had to run as fast as they could and be chased by the loser <laughs> and I couldn't coordinate it at all I couldn't do it ten goes didn't manage to do it once couldn't couldn't work it out all right so slightly pernicious I'm just going to push this back Just one round of this. Let's 
Good. Ten seconds does get progressively more strenuous, doesn't it? Well done. Shake it out. And we're going to go for the left leg. Let's go. Some beautiful lunges. Let's get the knee close to the mat. Shoulders here too. Halfway. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done.
I did think that when I spot first. I don't even think you could forgive me. Let's get those hips back and then straighten them out. 15 seconds. Pushing up through the balls of the feet, up onto the toes. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. Same. 
okay with cross country, so scissoring. Use your arms, counter balance. Can you jump a little bit wider, feel the resistance? Just walk around. 